that you are doing very well. Uh, my name is Ebenezer Amakwentri. Um, I'm a YouTuber and also I'm a graphic designer as well. I do video editing and other design works. Yes, and this is Adobe Photoshop tutorial that and we are going to do. And today we are going to try, I'm going just going to talk to you about an introduction, I mean, session about it. Actually, um, I'm having a problem with my tank. Yes, and you see, the by tutorial, um, I should have recorded it. The reason being that um, because of how my schedules are, I have to make sure that, for example, if, for example, tomorrow's, um, I mean, what we are going to watch the first video, I can't do it that we can't do it the previous week. So for example, as I'm shooting this video, next Saturday video I will shoot will be for the next Saturday, not the coming one. Yeah, so as at the time I'm shooting this video, I'm actually <coughs> um I'm actually having this time problem. So please do well in. I'm doing well and actually bear with me. <laughs> yes. So uh, basically, a graphic design always my personal definition I give to it is that um, someone that is able to communicate to people through graphics. That's why we have infographics. You talk, you advertise with some um yeah, like graphics. Now when someone sees it, it, it tells the person something. So that is what we, 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 I actually personally talk or uh, describe a graphic designer to be. Yes. And one thing to I normally actually um, tell people is that um, graphic design is not a difficult thing. It's very difficult thing. And because there is a course that um, all of us are going to teach us, I have to share some things more with you as part of the introductory session. Uh, myself, actually, I did um, general science in the NHS. In the university right now, I'm doing forestry. I realized that I, when you check my background from SHS to the university, I don't have any art. I mean, in terms of education, I don't have that kind of education. I was actually in art when I was um, from KG through to class 6. I was in the art field that I loved art. That one, my mom would testify. I was a lover of art, drawing and those kind of things. But I was not having much concept about art. Yes. So when I go to SHS, I came to develop interest in technical drawing. So I was very good by God's grace. In technical drawing and I loved it even though I was my favorite course was integrated science but I loved general arts I mean a technical drawing so much that was big DT and so we learned some small small basics about color and those kind of things but we couldn't go into details so when I completed school what made me learn graphic design initially was that I need the skill to earn some money that was by then we were introduced fiverr my brother introduced me he was making a lot of money on fiverr yes. now with the laptops that you are going to use i posted on the whatsapp platform i gave you the specs uh myself actually the, the laptop i used actually was not up to the specs i've given on the platform i'm, I'm saying that the, the least <coughs> the least amount that um you can the least specs that you can use okay the least specs that you can use actually should be that um you're having eight gig of ram and um yeah maybe five ten gig each gigs as a school and above and if you have at least one gig graphic card that one too is awesome but if you don't have it you can just try but with four gig um normally <laughs> The one that can be compatible for you is the how do I call it? This version of Photoshop. Uh, we have the CS6 yeah, extended. That is the one that we can. 
that's the one that you can um, actually deal with okay so please if your machine is not up to the specs I put it on WhatsApp please hit me up so that I can show us how to get the older version of Photoshop and we can also use those ones we can use it yes you see the thing is that Photoshop every year they keep on improving on their I mean softwares they keep on adding different effects and everything do what they do my time so <laughs> please bear with me okay yeah they keep on adding new features and keys to it yes but the, the CSS can do a whole lot of designs I'm telling you can do a whole lot of design so if I mean right now your your machine is not up to and you can't afford to get that standard I'm giving and you can just maintain it but I have my own machine in here that I'm actually use for my graphic design works and also if you actually um Let me check something on the machine. Yeah, so um, this this actually the machine I'm using in here. Yeah, mine is, I think the, the RAM is sixteen gig. <laughs> yeah, the RAM is sixteen gig. Yeah. The RAM is 16 gig, and also, um, yeah, it, it's seven in uh, NVIDIA Ryzen 7 and um, 6 gig dedicated graphic card. Yeah. So it makes the design when you're working like it, it makes it more loving and efficient as well. Mm -hmm. Makes efficient. And you see, with design, when you get a good graphic card, it helps you to enjoy what you are doing. It helps you to enjoy whatever thing that you are actually doing. We get it. it helps you to actually do that. So, what I want to say in this introductory session is that Photoshop is very easy. It's very easy. When you are starting, it will be a little bit tedious because you are not introduced. Actually, Photoshop, um, when I was learning it, I didn't find it that much difficult because earlier I had knowledge in, how do you call it? I had knowledge in, in design. And you see, it was an uh, Adobe product. So some of the tabs, I mean, yes, the tools were similar. Yeah. So if, if maybe you've, you've learned um, what's the name? Coral Draw before. It, it, this should be a little bit simple for you. Even Pixel Lab. So I, I did a Pixel Lab tutorial. Those of you. <coughs> um, love you. Who, who did the Pixel Lab tutorial? Um, I'm sure by now you have a lot of knowledge. You talk about dimension. We talked about colors. I, I'm sure I talked to you about shadows and those all those things are we are going to apply them here. That's what I'm saying that Photoshop is very, 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 very simple. Very simple. So please it, it's, it's not that tedious. Now I had wanted us to go through the PC now, but <laughs> my time is not helping me. So for this introduction session, um I'm going to link um a video in the description for you okay it is a previous video i did on photoshop 2020 and the introduction of the whole interface just make sure you watch it please in the next class um, i'll ask questions about it on the whatsapp platform to see how we learned it and if you are watching this video you are not on the whatsapp platform please check in the description my number is in the Hit me up and let me know why you want to join the Photoshop class. I'll add you to the platform. But if you feel like you are just following, you can do that and you can still be commenting and I'll be applying you on YouTube. Yeah. Just that on WhatsApp, there are a lot of things that um, we do in there on WhatsApp.
there are a lot of things that uh, when we start, we are going to do there. Yes. So that is that. My name once again is Ebenezer Amaku MG. And thank you very much. Please, um, if you have someone who also is interested, you can give my number to the person for the person to call me so that I add the person. This time, I don't want to share the, the link that I want that if, if people will join and be posting adverts and those kind of things. I want it to be that those who want those who are interested and are ready to learn, yeah, join the platform. But those those on the platform, that is the YouTube platform already. For them we are in, we are a family already. And I know some of them even subscribe to this channel because of the graphic design stuff that I was doing. So um that is all that we have for the introductory session. Um, with the installation of Photoshop, I have talked about it because I'm, I'm sure most of you are not having it. So what you do is that check in the description, okay? I have a Telegram link in the description. Click on that, that link. That is the Photoshop app that you should download. Just download it straight to your machine then we proceed i have two links i'll give you two links one you go to the the main website and download it yourself i think i'll do it that way so i'll leave the website link now you go there and download when you're when you're downloading they will show you how to i mean install the app when you follow the instruction they will give you then install it then from next to going i'll take my time i'm praying to god that the tank will be off <laughs> That I'll get the time to <clears throat> do a lot for you. Okay, so thank you very much for watching the video. Please make sure that I share this video with someone, like it, comment on it, and let's see how the future is going to be. I love you all. Goodbye. <laughs>